Hi, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hello, my name is Claire. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing video and it's the first unboxing of January. And it is, look fantastic. Ooh, this is what it looks like. It arrived this morning and yeah, I can't remember what spoilers were for last month and I haven't had any sneak peeks so it's a complete surprise to me. So I'm not sure, not sure what it is. It feels quite heavy and it's quite rattly. As always, if you're new to Look Fantastic, I will give you a quick lowdown about what it is. But if you've seen it all before and you would prefer to skip forward to seeing the actual contents, I will add a timestamp down below so you're free to flip forward. But yeah, so Look Fantastic then. So Look Fantastic is a beauty monthly subscription box. It costs £15 a month that includes shipping and it ships worldwide, which is amazing. Now, I've been a subscriber to Look Fantastic for over a year. Some months are better than others, but it's generally my top two subscription boxes alongside glossy box as well those two are my longer subscriptions and yeah I, ju I just love them both i think it's just value for money you get six items every month inside and they are a mix of makeup and skincare and accessories but it does tend to have a bit more of a skincare heavy sort of feel to it you get a good mix of high-end and drugstore products what i like about look fantastic is it gives me the opportunity to try serums and moisturizers and all that lovely stuff now that i'm in my 40s <laughs> I need it not that I didn't before but I'm more into it now that I'm getting a little bit older shall I say but they offer the chance to me to try creams and lotions and potions that I might not think about buying especially if they've got like a price bracket of like 70 80 pound or more not that I could easily go out and buy that straight away but if it's a product that I've fallen in love with like I remember I can't remember what box it was but it was a look fantastic box last year they had a little sample a five mil sample of Lancer facial oil oh my word I love it absolutely love it for 30 mils it's about 80 quid <laughs> so it is quite expensive but at the moment I've been buying samples just to keep up with it but it's something I will do it's something I will buy so I love that about look fantastic it does give me the opportunity to try brand that are a little bit out my reach shall we say but also that's not to say that they are better than cheaper versions but I just like the fact that I get to try things that I just wouldn't normally buy or try so enough of me blabbing on about my thoughts <laughs> inside the box you also get an L subscription so every month you get an L magazine which I'll show you when I open up and I think that's about £4.30 the magazine costs so you get it every month so if you're into your magazines your fashion magazines particularly then you will like the subscription as well and in here you get a leaflet and it tells you everything about the contents inside this box it doesn't tell me the price but I like to find that out so by the time this video is edited I will have up on screen the costs of the items and I will link absolutely everything down below so click on the show more that will bring up my description and everything related to this box will be down there I do have a 10% code off a 3, 6 and 12 month subscription I believe which I'll link that down below as well so yeah and the contents I'll seek them out and I'll link them down below so if you're interested to know a little bit more about the products then it, the information will be down there so I think that's it really I forgot to say it's a monthly subscription you can cancel any time and they offer a 3, 6 and 12 month subscription as well at a reduced cost but let's open it up they always come in these gorgeous boxes they're keepsake boxes they are really really lovely ah it just dawned on me there was not a sneak peek last month normally we have a sneak peek and yes normally I forget about it but no I do remember that on the last page I believe of the magazine which is here of last month's box they didn't mention a sneak peek so but they were changing things up a bit for 2019 so yes yeah, so I don't know what that means so as I said this is oh it's got a sneak peek on the back there so this is the magazine that tells you everything about the products and I'll be referring to this as we go along so what is the sneak peek for February <laughs> sneak peek is a sleek makeup face form palette okay so this is a contoured complexion that will enhance your features including a matte contour powder a radiant highlighter and a peachy blush this is an essential for finishing your makeup look so that's there I don't think I've had that before I've had quite a few sleek products before but I haven't tried that but those are definitely the colors I use so yes yeah, so I'm quite happy with that so this is the L magazine that I was talking about and what does it say here yeah £4.40 this would cost you if you were to go off and buy it in the shops but you get it free and then this is how it's wrapped oh 
I think I can see a familiar there. <laughs> and it's like, yeah, <laughs> it's shining through. So let's open it up. I love the colour. Oh, and looking on screen there, the colours look beautiful. They're all sort of complementary colours. Right, I'm not going to look. I'm going to pick up that first item. Now this is this is a regular two subscription box. There's nothing new, nothing exciting. It's a good product. It's Dr. Paw Paw and it's a multi-purpose soothing balm with natural paw paw for lips, skin, hair, beauty finishing and cuticles. It's fragrance free, it's cruelty free and it's vegan and this is a full size 25ml. Now I have got a ton of these ton of them i have got lots of mini ones which i keep in my handbag and i've given them to the children as well but yeah i'm a bit underwhelmed to have it in a look fantastic box i think we've had them i'm sure we've had them before in look fantastic i know i've had them in other subscription boxes but uh yeah a little bit underwhelmed but if it's your first time getting this then it is a good product so let's see what the information says although i should know this by now <laughs> And it says a staple in our beauty routine this award-winning multi-purpose balm contains fermented pawpaw an ingredient that contains natural healing properties this all-natural fragrance-free balm made in the uk is designed to deeply nourish and soothe and can be used not only as a lip balm but also for cuticles dry skin or on damaged hair it's a sheet mask and it's by Vita Masks, and it's marine gold dust sheet masks made of real gold dust marine collagen and it's a plumping one a luxurious moisturizing korean face mask made with gold dust and marine collagen to plump your skin i like Vita Masks. i've used quite a few of their masks we do we have had quite a few in subscription boxes before but i've never tried that one and that one looks quite exciting i have got loads i have got loads but i love them <laughs> I love them I've got a big drawer full of them and I use them regularly but because I also have another subscription box called mask time you <laughs> know it keeps on like building up so no never disappointed unless it's the same sort of mask that we're getting all the time in different subscription boxes then that would bore me but we don't we, this is new and yeah no I do like getting them so so if you're getting a look fantastic this January you will get one of four masks I've got the marine gold mask there's also black gold mask there's diamond gold gold mask or a rose gold mask and it says inspired by Korean skincare this mask is made with real gold dust to give your skin the ultimate treatment fitting seamlessly onto the face this ultra fine mask enhances moisture levels to deeply nourish and soothe the skin so you know quite like that and it sounds quite good as well could do with some plumping although <laughs> I've been naturally plumping over the last couple of weeks due to Christmas I can always do with some plumping out my fine lines <laughs> So next item, we've got, these are massive, these are really big, oh my gosh, they're pop bands by Look Fantastic, so it's like a limited edition for Look Fantastic, I'm assuming we have had limited edition bath bombs in the past as well, which are lovely, so these are by Pop Band London, and I love the colours, really, really nice, I'll just take this cellophane off because it tends to um, be glare. Right, that's what they look, woo, how do I show you, like that, that's what they look like there, the colours are beautiful aren't they, unfortunately for me I don't like them, <laughs> oh no, not a good start to this box, <sighs> I don't like them, although these are bigger, let me pull one off, these are bigger, can you see, we've had loads of these, mainly in, um, pink parcel we get a load in pink parcel but i can't use them on my hair now they're supposed to be like kink free snag free and everything but my hair i'm wearing a halo hair piece so the bottoms of my hair is thickened up a bit but the tops of my hair is quite fine and when i you know it's, it's long it's long but it's quite fine when i'm having a no makeup day or if i've just got out of shower or something i'll tie my hair up in a big messy bun and i've tried these before or the smaller versions of these by a different brand i think they were and oh they are a nightmare to get out my hair really really hard i've tried doing it looser but then they just fall out so for me i just can't use them in my hair at all which is a shame these are really pretty though i like the colors of these but they are a lot bigger so it might be better on my hair I don't know but yeah a little underwhelmed again oh no second product I will give them a go because they're bigger they might work but if not I got a 12 year old daughter who loves these things so I'm sure that she would gain okay from them so it claims to be the world's kindest hair tie but not if you've got long thin hair <laughs> very thin hair like myself 
to know why it doesn't work. I'd love to know if you've got very fine, thin hair and long, like myself, have you tried these ties? I'd love to know what they're like in your hair as well. I can see them working, you know, with thicker hair. My daughter has got really long, down to the bum length hair, and yeah, it's they're fine they're completely fine but it's just my type of hair i don't think it works designed to leave your hair fresh and kink free pop bands are essential for wearing your hair up these gym ready hair ties are made from a wide elastic that doesn't snag hair but instead means that hair is styled comfortably something called swell and it's ultimate protect and renew serum Ooh, i haven't seen this before swells ultimate protect and renew serum smooths add gloss and conceals splitter ends oh for some reason i was assuming it's for my face but it's not from here right adds gloss and conceals split ends giving state-of-the-art heat protection and the ultimate professional finish oh wow and it says after blow drying hair apply using one to four pumps of serum to mid lengths and ends depending on your hair length and density work the product through into even distribution then blow drying style is normal so that's what we've got there and this is a 30 ml Oh, it smells really nice. It smells like a spa. I need more. <laughs> My hair is in desperate need of it. Hold on. But it smells like aromatherapy oils. I can smell lemongrass. Um, yeah, no, it feels really nice. Really, really nice. And it doesn't feel tacky and it doesn't feel too like slimy either. I'm just messing around in my hair now. Giving it a bit of body, a bit of texture. <laughs> But I'm just looking for the viewfinder so it could actually be like a, a complete nest. I don't know. <laughs> but I'll have a look afterwards. But no, it feels nice anyway. I, I'm a trained hairdresser. That's what I did years and years ago. So yeah, so I have an idea of what type of hair products are good and bad, especially for my own hair. So no. On first impressions, I quite like that. So what does it say? Create sleek, smooth and hydrated hair with a silicone-free and weightless formula designed to create salon-worthy results at home. This multitasking serum helps to control frizz, reduce the appearance of split ends and create a glossy look. I think I just read that to I off the back. And it says, a little goes a long way. Even if you have dry hair, we'd suggest only applying a pea-sized amount. Unlike me. <laughs> but no, it feels nice. But again... I don't know what it looks like but it does feel quite nice in my hair so no really happy with that hello fab and it's by first aid beauty it's a coconut skin smooth priming moisturizer for safe for sensitive skin oh right and this is a 21.3 gram so this looks like a sample or a deluxe sample or travel size maybe and we've had a few first aid beauty products i think in look fantastic and yeah they've been lovely hand cream i think has been my favorite go oh it's got almost like um like a color i like that <laughs> i like a bit of a color but you can't see it once it's blended into your skin and it's got almost like a dewy sort of look to it not shimmery not glittery not sparkly or anything like that but oh it feels nice yeah not much of a smell so it says discover the coconut water infused oil-free multitasking complexion enhancer that instantly brightens moisturizes and smooths in one step simply apply to the skin for a blurred complexion that is perfectly prepped for makeup application that sounds amazing so i'm not really happy with that so our last item is oh <laughs> okay three out of three is not too bad i suppose but it's a banana setting powder it's bella pierre again this is a great product if it suits your skin it doesn't suit my skin it's yeah i can't use yellow based um powders because it just makes me look ill it makes me look really ill i'm too pale i'm too pale for them it's just yeah it just makes me not look healthy whatsoever you know it's bella pierre bella pierre is brilliant i love the brand i love their lipsticks and everything it's just this powder is just not for me and we've had it a few times in subscription boxes I'm not sure if we've had it in look fantastic before but i know i've probably had it in a glossy box maybe pink parcel i'm not too sure but yeah so not for me it's good for baking baking out carving out those cheekbones and you know under your eyes and things like that so it's supposed to be a color corrector but um yeah doesn't really work on my skin unfortunately so what's the information say here this yellow toned color correcting loose setting powder is essential for brightening lackluster skin for makeup that will last all day use a powder to set foundation and concealer in place 
So those are all the items, so I'll just gather them all up. Here we go, Ooh, we've got a all-in-one moisturising primer, we've got a mask, we've got some hair bands, we've got a banana setting powder, uh, we've got a miracle balm, and we've got a hair serum. <laughs> Hold on, there. There, hopefully you can all see them there. There's two products which I'm really, really excited about. It's the hair serum and the moisturizer, the face moisturizer. Those two, really excited about. And the mask, I know I'm gonna like that, hopefully, because I like Vita masks and they seem to do really nicely on my skin as well. But it's the Dr. Paul Paul. We've just had a load of them, a load of them. And I'm sure we've had them in Look Fantastic before. We've had these pop bands before and this banana set powder it was a firm subscription box favorite last year but it is a familiar definitely a familiar but whether it's look fantastic or not I'm not sure so for me personally love the colors the colors are stunning the actual boxes and the products they've chosen very color coordinating but a little bit underwhelming for me and it's mainly because of the repeats so as always I'd love to know your thoughts what do you think of this month's box have you been a regular to look fantastic how does this compare to previous boxes all your thoughts I'd love love to know so please comment down below and if you haven't done so already please subscribe to my channel I've got lots of videos <laughs> lined up so thanks for watching and I'll speak to you soon take care bye bye